Welcome viewers, this is Green Gaia Tarot and this is your next 7 days career and finance pick a card reading. So take a deep breath, select your option from pile number 1, 2 and 3 and we will start the reading from pile number 1. Welcome pile number 1, this is your next 7 days career and finance pick a card reading. Let's start the reading with your tarot then we will follow your oracle cards. Pile number 1, your first card is the tower card. Release, Revelation, the Major Arcana. Next you have Six of Shells, that is Sentiment and Joy. And the final card is the Sun, Validity and Joy. So, another Major Arcana. I can tell you right away at this point that there will be many opportunities or success coming in your way that will give you joy because joy came twice in the cards your first card is the tower card this is the card that tells about divine intervention regarding some changes major changes in your career at this point of time these changes are inevitable you must not resist them and go through with them because once you are moving forward with the changes you will see that there are opportunities in your life that will come to you that once you thought is lost this also indicates about a partnership or a collaboration that can benefit you in the long run or help you to pursue your heart's desire regarding your career and finance situation that is the six of cups next you have the sun card pardon me one more thing with the six of cups i can tell you you might be collaborating with a friend of yours with whom you won't in touch for long and now in this week you guys are coming together to create something better for your future then you have the sun card validity and joy sun card is the blessing opportunity new beginning card and this is the card that tells me that things are going to be really wonderful and successful prosperous in your path ahead so next seven days career and finance situations looking really good if you don't resist the change and embrace it with open heart and mind so let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards your first card says you are being helped heaven is working behind the scenes to help you even if you don't see the results yet so at this point of time you might not be able to see the results but help is there as the tower card was coming in changes and opportunities to reconstruct your future is given to you by the heaven so you must not lose trust or faith or confidence in you in the divine and in your path ahead your next card is get more information this is the card that tells you to gather more information to definitely have a foolproof plan ahead if you have more information or communication with the people who have the information or someone who is inspiring you and giving you some words of wisdom, you will definitely get the benefit in the long run. Your final card is writer's group. Create or join a writer's group to gain inspiration, friend sorry, friendship and support. So, this is the card that is here to remind you about the Six of Cups also. You are collaborating or partnering up with someone who is very much like-minded or a friend and who is there to support you, inspire you and definitely be on this journey ahead of you with you. So, Pile number one, this was your next seven days career and finance pick a card reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. 
Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great week ahead. Welcome pile number two. This is your next seven days career and finance with card reading. Let's see what we have for you in the tarot. Then we will see your oracle cards. Your first card is three of acorns. That is the three of wands. Foresight, exploration. Next you have four of shells. That is the four of cup. Soul searching, re-evolution. Next you have two of shells. That is the two of cups, union and harmony. Then you have the extra card, king of feathers, logic and justice. So pile number two. In this week, you are planning ahead and you are ready to get out of your comfort zone towards your better and brighter future. You are working hard and probably connecting with some people or opportunities from foreign land or far land from yours and these are the connection that will bring you more better and brighter opportunities and situations ahead of you in the future for your career and finance situation and you need to explore these opportunities for sure your next card is four of shells that is the four of cups soul searching re-evolution this is the card that tells that you are going to be in your head for most of the time in this week and you are thinking contemplating about your selection of choices and you are pretty much spending time thinking about your past decisions that might have been a little bit disappointing but let me remind you four of shells is the card that tells about you losing an opportunity thinking about the past so you must not do so yes thinking and contemplating evaluating is something that is very much important but while doing that don't lose opportunities that are there for you for future your next card is two of shells that is the two of cups union and harmony this is the card that tells me that either you are going to launch some work or project with your family or loved ones and that will be beneficial for you or you are collaborating or partnering up with someone who is going to be very beneficial towards your path ahead they can be inspirational and they can be a friendly support things will be smooth selling when they are around your next card is the king of feathers logic and justice this is your extra card that tells me with the king of feathers that is the king of swords you are going to follow more sorry find more information and communication regarding the work situations because this is something that is big and you are very much into it you are going to be fair and square about every step of it and definitely you are standing strong in your ground with your clear communication so that was your tarot for the next seven days for your career and finance situation let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards yes your first card is set your sights higher increase your standards and expect more for yourself don't settle yes three of wands was there to tell you exactly the same thing you are expanding this is your time to reach for the star don't stay stuck or don't settle for anyone for anything your next card is recovery this is the card that tells you to learn how to say no setting healthy boundaries are very much needed don't let anyone rain on your parade this is your time to heal this is your time to recover and definitely take care of yourself your next and final card is birth new life such as a baby an idea happy news or an exciting project blossoms within and around you yes this was also indicated with the tarot 
previously you are definitely launching some new projects or new ideas are there for your better and brighter future things are looking good so pile number two this was your next seven days career and finance with card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great week ahead welcome pile number three this is your next seven days career and finance with a card reading let's start the reading with the tarot then we will follow your oracle cards pile number three your first card is seven of crystals options results this is the seven of pentacles Next, you have Knight of Feathers, Action, Focus. This is the Knight of Swords. Next, you have the Moon card, Imagination, Perception. So, this is the Major Arcana. Pile number three. This is going to be a week when you need to be patient with yourself, with your situations. You have done the hard work that is needed. You planted the seed to succeed and it is time for you to definitely be patient because the results of your hard work is on the way and there is no doubt about it things will definitely be fruitful soon enough your next card is knight of feathers action and focus this is the knight of swords you are following more information communication and you are definitely very much focused in your path you are taking action you are not sitting back idle while you are waiting that's really good your next card is the moon card imagination and perception this is the card that tells about you moving forward with your strong intuitive nature you are following your gut feeling and being prepared for everything and anything that can come into your path still there are things that you need to know because the moon card always tells about deception and not knowing if there is someone or some energies that can sabotage any situation you need to be prepared or you need to be prepared anyway if there was any sort of competition happening in future you need to be well prepared before that this is the card also that tells about your creative ideas and thoughtfulness that you are going to follow for your better and brighter future so pile number three this was your tarot for next seven days for career and finance let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards your first oracle card says accept heaven's help you have prayed for help so get out of the way and let heaven help you so this is a card that tells that you need to let go and let god at this point of time if there is any kind of help there you need to stand aside don't stand in the way of the help and if you need help ask for it no one can understand exactly what you need as help if you don't ask praying and hoping is good definitely you prayed and the help is here but if you don't ask no one can just jump into it and help you so don't stand in the way ask your next card is be assertive you need to remain positive and hopeful because if you are disheartened and think that you are stuck that will only delay your progress to manifest your desired outcomes you need to be assertive you need to be open-minded and open-hearted to embrace the in-between before the success your next card is perfectionism polishing your creative project is fine but don't allow perfect sorry perfect oh pardon me perfectionistic fear to result in procrastination so this is the card that tells about you being so much into the perfectionism that you are not being able to let go of that energy and just act 
yes you have the skill now is the time for you to move forward as you can see there are some hiccups that can come it's only natural you cannot know every path as i was reading the card i fumbled twice but that didn't stop me i'm still reading that is the way yes being prepared having things in the line definitely good but you need to act now because now is the time for you to act if you only concentrate on your skill to be perfect and perfect and perfect there is no way you can tell that it is at the best even the best of the best do some mistakes or have some hazards in their path and that's how overcoming them they get more skilled your next card is keep going this is your extra card use the energy of any disappointment to fuel your creative project with authentic emotion just i was telling you that you need to keep going no matter what if there are disappointments in your path just use them as the fuel towards your creative projects and pour in your authentic emotions the true you needs to come out in your work your truth needs to reflect in your energy so pile number 3 this was your next 7 days career and finance pick a card reading if you like my reading please like share comment and subscribe thank you very much for your participation have a great week ahead so viewers this was your next 7 days career and finance pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great week